if we want to do this as a real business, we can expand. Finding, like finding places in Geneva also is not so easy because you need place. We can reach 1,000, 2,000 safe and have completely different service. In this case, we have to make them charge also. But this is not the most important, Patrick. The most important is maybe if tomorrow I'm telling you we have 200 or 2,000 safe, maybe we will not find maybe enough cigars of top quality to fill them. And for me, really the key master why we did this is because we understood that to find quality is not easy and you know that better than me that's why i prefer to have a zone which has 750 safe okay and even with 750 is not easy to find every day when people ask me i want this reference of cigars and i tell them monsieur you have to wait six eight months that i find the right cigars which you're looking for you shows you how it's difficult to find quality. Quality is not something that comes, no. It's really, when I'm talking quality, I'm talking about the quality of the tobacco, I'm talking quality of the blending, I'm talking about the quality of the manufacturer, I'm talking the tobacco. Some tobaccos are excellent to be kept, some other ones not. Why? Because we face to a natural product. This natural product will react differently. That's why from one year to the other one is not always the same. That's why one, from one harvest to the other harvest, from one manufacturer to the other. This is why I do not think to make this a big place. Why? Because my problem would be, in this case, to advise also the people and to find what they're looking for. Mm -hmm. You see wh what I mean? Can you explain how you're preserving this? For example, this is a locker for one of your customers. Yes. In terms of uh, temperature, in terms of humidity. Technology of... The technology <laughs> here. Uh, the, no, the, the, the thing is, we n need three things to make a good cigar we, for, for aging. We, we do not keep cigars here like we keep them in the stores. Why? Because uh, when we start to age cigars, we, we will keep them in another temperature. We will keep them with another humidity. We, all right. Based on this, what we saw, what is very important also is air how to bring new air, how to clean the air out. That's why when you see all those doors open like this, see, with an opening, why? Because the air is coming from the back and we have a high pressure of air on the back who goes in very slowly and are taking back with the mouth on, on, on the ceiling. But like this, we have a turn of air and this is very important also. On the other hand, the freshness and the humidity we need, that how you feel inside, is very important to age the cigar properly. And what's the you temperature know, you're keeping in? Here we are keeping at 17.3. But I'm telling you something you will understand very well. To make a good cigar, when we start aging, when we start making even in the vintage, it's like cooking old food. You have to go very slowly. If you do it fast, the tobacco will start to crisp himself and stop it. We don't know why. But if you go slowly, it's like cooking a very old plate and you will see your cigar will keep his oilness, will keep his freshness. I want to show you something which is very important and you will understand. Let me to show you the old tobacco, how is vintage. 